Oh, hello there, friends. Today, we're going to play with lots of different fruits. And I think we'll start with this one. Do you know what it is? It's a delicious strawberry. We'll make one with this cutter and stamp. Now tell me, what color is a strawberry? Yes, they're red. Spooshy, spishy, splat. Let's make the dough nice and flat. I'll need a rolling pin for the rest. The more I roll, the flatter it gets. Perfect. So this part makes the outline of our fruit. And this one adds all the little details. Wow, it looks like a real strawberry. Check this out, friends. Am I right? The top part is the stem, and these are the seeds. The top is green and leafy. Here it goes! We never eat that part. Yuck! Now I'll add the little seeds. Strawberries are a yummy, healthy snack. Do you like strawberries? What letter does strawberry start with? The letter S! Let's work on this fruit next. Bim bam, bapes! Our next fruit is grapes! <laughs> and what color are grapes? Purple! That's right! Not all grapes are purple, though. They can be green, or yellow, black, or pink. It's time for our rolling pin. Hey, did you know that raisins are actually grapes that have dried up? Isn't that cool? The dough is ready. Now we can make our grape shape. Don't forget the stamp. I can hold on to this and push it down. Did it work? It did! Hooray! But we should add a little more color, shall we? Grapes also have stems. These cling to the vines on which grapes grow. My favorite type of grape is grape jelly! Yum! And the word grapes starts with the same letter as good, grin, and gum. The letter G. G for grapes. This one looks interesting, friends, but I'm not really sure what it is. Hmm. Of course, it's an apple. And apples grow on trees. Since our apple is green, we need green dough. Hey, it already looks like an apple. <laughs> but I'll smish, smash, smoosh it to make a better one. Here's a super awesome fact. There are over 7,500 different kinds of apples. Wowie, that's a huge number. Remember the next step? Yes, we need to cut out the sides. Then we will push in the stamp. You can do lots of different things with apples. You can make pies and cakes. You can even make candy apples. But I love eating apples just as they are. Look at this nice little apple we've got here, friends. We should add a stem and a leaf to the top. Here it goes. Well, this is our apple. And the word apple starts with the letter A, like ant, animal, and art. Ooh, our next fruit shape is hiding in the magic candy dish. Let's see. This is the outside. Uh-huh. And this is the inside. It's a pineapple. And this fruit comes from South America. Hmm. I think I'll use yellow for this fruit. 
To grow your own pineapple, you take the leafy top and plant it into the ground. You can try doing that. Rolling pin time! All right, I hope this will work. Extra dough, go away. We will use you another day. Out comes the stamp. Hop! And up comes the cutter. And we're left with a particularly perfect pineapple. Its top is called the crown and is made out of hard, spiky green leaves. And the skin is rough and bumpy, too. You can't eat the skin at all. It would be like eating bark. But the inside of this fruit is juicy and sweet. Just a few more lines and we'll be done. Well, friends, this is what a pineapple looks like. Doesn't it look yummy? And the word pineapple starts with the letter P. P for pie, pig, and plant. And for a pineapple. The magic candy dish has something else in it. Wow. What is it? Ah, uh, I know, I know. It's a watermelon. And it's my most favorite fruit of all. Watermelons have a green outside but a red inside, so I'll use red dough for this one. Squish, squish, squash. I like this bit the best. Beep boop bin. Here comes the rolling pin. Watermelons are bigger than most fruit. That's why I'm only making a watermelon slice this time. Here's the stamp. Ooh, I think we did it, friends! Time for the big reveal! Yay! What a wonderful watermelon we've got here! The outside is called the rind, and inside is the bit you can eat. The rind is green and doesn't taste very good. It looks like a big green smile, doesn't it? <laughs> and inside, you'll find little black seeds. You'd better not eat them, too. I just need one more seed. There. It's a nice-looking watermelon slice. And the word watermelon begins with the letter W. Wow! Hit like and subscribe for more fun learning videos. Bye for now!